Um, hi, brothers and sisters in Christ. Um, I just wanted to take make this video to talk a little about a little bit about Mormonism. So um, I wasn't really familiar what Mormons believed. Um, I, 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 but I see them a lot, like walking on my street. Um, the men with the the white wedding dress shirts and with the ties. So I thought I always thought um, they're like um, I was giving them props. I'm like, wow, they're good Christian. Um, they're passionate about their beliefs and they're getting the word across. That's how I usually thought about them. And then, and then after I actually looked into what they believed, I was really surprised. I'm like, how did they? How did they believe some of these things? That's why I'm gonna go over some of the things they believe in. And after, after you hearing what you have to, what I have to say, you're not gonna consider Mormons Christian anymore. There's no Mormonism is not Christianity. It's it's, uh, it's something else. There's the, the I know a lot of people like the debate how it's Christianity. Mormonism is their ideas. You can decide for yourself if it's Christianity or not. After I go over some of their ideas, and also they're so they're so passionate about their beliefs. Like I was driving in the rain, it was pouring hard, and I saw a couple of Mormons. They were evangelizing, going to house house to house, so that they're that passionate that they um, even evangelize in heavy weather, but the stuff they believe in that's not why why would anyone anyone that considers themselves a christian evangelize that so okay this is what they believe in and these are some of the ideas that they believe in there's a lot more that's not that has nothing to do with christianity but i can't include them all here so i'm just going to go over some things they believe in first of all um they believe god came from another planet they believe god is a man with body and flesh and they believe there are many gods there are endless gods, and one of them is God the Father. They also believe God and His wife are married. They believe that the Trinity is three separate gods, and they believe you can become gods. So, like, I'm not sure if it's through works or through faith, but they believe that the more works you do in this in this life, you can become a god in the afterlife. I mean, doesn't this ring a bell? Don't you remember the first lie that ever was told to mankind? Satan told Eve, to eat the apple you'll become like god i mean mormonism came straight from the devil's mouth like how how can a christian religion teach that you can become become god and i'm gonna continue and also they teach jesus and satan are brothers i'm like are you kidding me how can you teach something like that and consider yourself a christian they believe you can become a god and create your own world now i realize why they're so passionate about their works that of, of their evangelism they think in the afterlife, because of their evangelism, they, they're going to be exalted and they can become gods and create their own worlds. I mean, this is just ridiculous. They believe the Garden of Eden was in Missouri. <laughs> this was pretty funny. They believe Earth was created by Michael, Jesus, and Adam. I mean, if they read the Bible, it clearly says who created Earth. I, I don't get where Michael and Adam came from. Of, of how, I don't get how Michael and Adam would contribute to creating a creating earth. That's ridiculous. Um, they believe that you need Joseph Smith's permission to get to heaven. Well, the problem with this is how can you believe that? So how did people get to heaven before Joseph 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 Smith was born, or Joseph Smith got there? I mean, and they also um, another ridiculous belief to have is that the Holy Spirit sleeps at midnight. And they also, this one's crazy. I, I don't even believe how they believe this. They believe there are people on the moon and the sun living there. So after, and these are some of the beliefs I just went over. They have, there's a lot more. You can do your own, you can do your own research. I mean, I still don't understand how this is up for debate that Mormonism is a Christian, is a Christian church. Sure. Mormonism is not Christianity. Just read a Christian Bible. Majority of majority, if not all of the Mormonism beliefs contradict with any any real Christian Bible. Their beliefs are ridiculous, and this is complete blasphemy towards a Christian church because they consider themselves Christian. If they did not consider them, because they consider themselves Christian, this is blasphemous towards the Christian church. And what I think is that Joseph Smith started this religion as a joke, and he thought like he wanted to see if it actually was spread as a joke to see how gullible people are and it actually spread Mormonism. Mormonism is a very fast growing religion and I think every time there there's a new Mormon con convert the devil laughs. This is completely ridiculous with some of their ideas. It's, don't you dare call Mormonism Christianity. 
This is what I wanted to share and please in the description box of this video I have a message about uh, just read it, share however you can, print it out, email it, text it, do anything you can to get the word across. We, we need to warn people of the upcoming events. And thanks for listening. All glory to God because all glory belongs to Him.